Hello everyone, I am Cali of Gaming and welcome back to another episode of the Motorsport Manager Zero to Hero <laughs> series. Today it's episode 19 and we're going to go to the Milan Grand Prix. Let's head to the standings of the Formula 2 uh, 2020 uh, with quotation mark of course uh, standings and it we are uh, 9th and 16th right now so that's not too bad I guess. So, um, pit crew side of things, things are going much worse than that. Um, everyone's basically in yellow except for one guy, so we need to change them out. And, uh, yeah, situation is not that great overall. So we need to swap the green guys with, like, less mistake chances. Uh, with the red and yellow guys because they are absolutely tired and uh, not great not suitable for uh, going for the right going to the races and doing pit uh, pit stops no they aren't they aren't inevitably they'll just mi make mistakes so we Actually, we need to hire more people. We'll need to hire new people with uh, less mistake chances to do stuff, I guess. Yes. And, uh. Probably. I, I just don't know. I really don't know. Just saying. Because these guys are. I think it's pretty decent. So let's just switch out some of those really high mistake chances, guys. And, uh. Yeah, we'll just continue on from there. Let's see. This this guy, pretty decent, I think so. So, uh, it's already switched in, I think. Probably, we still have three. And, uh... Yeah, we, we can probably hire another one. With quite good fixing, I mean, yes. So, um... We're gonna switch with one of them. And I am probably going for uh, F LRs. I don't know. I don't know who that is, by the way. No idea. And uh, yeah. So let's just continue. And we still have one tire crew, which is yellow and we're just gonna switch one of those yellow uh, guys in it just to uh, the the less mistake ch uh, percentage of the crew guy I don't know yeah that guy to get in and uh, yeah go to the inbox to mail part of stuff um, of course Kvyat uh, gets Paul um, in Ardenez, and actually Ardenez is not a good a race for us. That's quite poor, to be fair. So, um, yeah. And of course the video corrupted, so lost a lot of footage. That is basically the 90% of the footage that I can uh, present, I guess, I'll say. So, yeah, that's really sad. Formula 1 uh, stuff, I don't really care. And, uh, yeah, Equipe Dams wins in Ardennes at last. That is, that is it, basically, in Ardennes. That's the whole story, it basically. Just tells the whole story thing, I guess. Um, so... Probably let's just continue to the next part. Probably going to the car side, I don't know. Because it's quite important, I guess. And, uh, yeah, car repair is done. So, I mean, we can design a new part, but we don't have that much money. We need to think of that as well. Um, so now it's the F1 Singapore GP, round 16, I think. Or well, 15 and uh, oh wow it's it's a Mercedes one too but in Singapore not in Australia not in Bahrain not in China in Singapore that might be some kind of spoiler alert uh, of to this 
this uh, season of F1, maybe Singapore, you'll see that. Uh, we don't know yet, so, yeah. So basically, we don't have anything to improve. Um, yeah, those guys are really not doing anything, so I should not pay them anything. But, they need to work, so let's just build a gearbox. Gearbox is like the worst. And, uh, yeah, I think we can afford it, of course. Um... We're gonna go for that one, maybe. No, oh, actually, we should do the average first. Acceleration plus 15, build time plus 2, and then acceleration plus 20, I think. Reliability plus something. Uh, and uh, some goods, I think, probably. And that risk level. We're just gonna choose that risk level, minus 1. But that costs us 1 million. And, uh, yeah, that isn't great. <clears throat> To be fair, so 2.1 million Jesus Christ gearbox. That is what I call expensive. That is very expensive. But I can't do anything really. To be fair, no, I can't. Because it, I don't have stuff. So um, track Melon GP, and we're gonna travel to Melon today and uh fit pass is all fine and here it goes for the f2 2020 season season two as known as round 10 italy italian gp or the milan gp as we call it so now it is friday practice everyone loves it why not <laughs> just to say, just to say that um we're gonna uh, let Laxinen and Dalravala out, same as usual, um, <coughs> bit of more downforce, actually we're just gonna load the setup from the past, let's see if we have, we have quite a bit, uh, from Campos Jr. or Cali of Racing, like, the, the, ser uh, the, Series that I just play, I don't record. It's Cali of Racing, of course. If you want to see something like Cali of Racing, please comment down below, let me know. And uh, maybe we can uh, do a series like Create My Own Team. Or, yeah, I, I have quite a few ideas on this motorcycle manager. There is a lot of ideas you can do because there's a lot of mods and stuff like that. And, uh, yeah, so let's send both of them out right now. And, uh, yeah. So, actually, I just want to talk a little bit more uh, other stuff. There's a DLive going on. DLive, it's a platform, it's a live streaming platform. And uh, it is for us creators to live stream. And you can actually earn from this platform and actually if you don't know I'm just gonna say that uh, PewDiePie is uh, have live stream on this platform very recently and uh, yeah he donated quite a lot of Lino it is a currency in this platform like twitch you got the bits I mean yes you got it you got the bits it's basically like bits but it is Lino in DLive this platform and actually it's very amazing you can earn quite a lot and actually if you watch like those live streams, you can earn the these Linos but of course uh, uh, you need 2,000 Linos to get a checkout so that is probably quite a long time but uh, go ahead to DLive um, log in like, like just sign up an account and follow my channel it's of course called Kelly of gaming and uh, yeah I will be live streaming I actually I have live streamed quite a few times already like these past few days and uh, yeah so actually the next episode episode I think it's 20 I have live streamed on D live and uh, yeah I I've already uh, recorded it and I live streamed on DLive 
So you you can see stuff on the screen that usually you won't. So yeah. So that is the practice session of after I've talked a lot about D Live. So yeah, just follow my uh uh channel. I am on the way to 200 followers, and uh, yeah, and just donate some, some some Linos to me, help me, because I need money, I desperately need money, so yeah. So now it's qualifying, Saturday, and uh, we, I don't really care about qualifying to be fair, because you know, qualifying doesn't mean anything, like, like, Laxon, usually it doesn't mean anything now. Like, these few races. He just started at the back, like, P17, and he still gets, like, P4, P5. Like, he always do that. There's no point. Because he got the that OP refueling, repu refueling like, OP uh, stat. 50% faster. That's Jesus Christ. He, like, Lax, uh, Menchaka is showing us the real pace of our car. Well, actually, it's just because that crazy stats, that boost in like crazy. I mean, yes, we're, we're still not there. We, are, we aren't, we aren't there yet. Um, just to say about that. So yeah. So now, as you can see, Laxanen is down in P20. Minchaka, P12. That's easy for Minchaka, of course, because he got that super overtake mode that, that just boosts him a lot. I'm just going to tell you that Laxton is going to just, I don't know, maybe get a podium. Like, real. Real. For real. So, yeah. Because um, when he pits, he just jumps... His teammate, even like they, they should be really close. Uh, when the, the the race started, and sorry about that, phone call or ringing sound. I don't, I can't control it. It's not me, of course. Um, so yeah, P17. He doesn't get in you into uh, Q2, but I definitely, I can say to you that he can uh, get into the points. So. Yeah, of course, it's P P17 now. Vershu out, Delatraz out, Jeffrey out, and one more guy out. I can't see who that is, but that's all right. Let's get into Q2. And actually, yeah, our car isn't there because we need to save money. We desperately need to save money. So, um, yeah. So, Minchaka let him out again. And, uh, yeah, Addi some more, some more additional news, um, remember to see my live stream on, uh, 4th of May, that is the 24 hour Nürburgring, and I'm definitely gonna crash, definitely, yes, I'm going to crash, I hope I won't, of course, it's a team thing, so, um, yeah, Menchaka 9th, Let's just get him a new, another set of soft ties and get out. And, uh, yeah. So definitely watch my live stream then. And it's going to be awesome. Awesome. Of course, like, um, the first two hours, I'm just going to sit there and do nothing. Because it's not my turn. It is, uh, probably start, start from the third hour, the second hour of the live stream to fourth hour from the live stream. Um, I'm, I, I think I'm going to be driving. So, yeah. So, Kvyat um, gets into Q3, of course. I mean, Chaka gets into Q3. He usually gets into Q3 now. I mean... It is less than like the start of the season because we can't develop anything right now, and uh, yeah, we need to save save up the money just to uh, yeah, just to save up. We can't do anything, so we're gonna go for a worn set of tires to get a new lap, 
and uh, yeah, I don't want to use medium. Mediums is very poor of a selection of tire. It is. It is a very poor selection of tire. But I can't do anything. So yeah, Nchaka doing awesome right now. <laughs> no, he's not. He's just green sector. Green sector two again. Crosses line. Now is B10, of course. But we can't. We just can't use that soft tire. That new set of soft. We need to uh, preserve it for the race. And uh, yeah, we can't use it. We really can't use it. And sorry about that. My my voice is a bit iffy. I'm just saying. I, I don't know why. Don't know why. Like these two days, it's a bit, a little bit heavy. But I think it's all right. Maybe it's just after the camp, like you know, I I gone to camp of uh, uh, because of scout. So yeah, that's another thing. Um, so now it's Sunday race in Milan. P10 and P17. Light so uh, light footed soft ties race trim for Menchaka. Light uh, pit stop guru fueling. I know that's OP. I I really trust Laxnin to get into top ten. Definitely, unless he f he effed up. I, I I don't know unless he effed up. This this probably or unless the car just fell apart, broke apart. Don't know. That's five lights. And away we go, Menchaka gets a flyer and gets into P9. Absolute amazing job. Laxinen, P16. Of course, Millen is an absolute overtaking uh, crazy track. Overtaking race. Just, just crazy. And uh, I think Laxinen will show you how to overtake in this race. He's down in P16 right now. He already he has already gained a place. Meanwhile, Minshaka P7 gained three places. As you can see, it's just an oh absolutely overtaking Murr race or whatever. Jesus Christ. Um I have nothing to say about it. Um P15 already laxing in. Menchaka holding P7, try to ta challenge P6 right now, will he get P6? He's absolute overtaking, he's gaining and he's gaining, he's switching left and right, left and right, and he gets P6 off the line, there he goes. Now it's P3, P4, as you can see, Laxanen somehow half the pace, overtaking Masterclass, and yeah, Laxanen will teach you how to overtake, not Minchaka. Minchaka's just, he's really poor, I mean, yes he is. Maxinen teaches you how to uh, overtake. And I think I'm consider switching Laxinen out, he's not performing that well. No, it isn't, he isn't, he really isn't. Although our car's somewhere there, I want outperforming, like Laxinen is doing. So Minchaka gets into the pits, Laxanen though, staying out another lap. Um, we'll just kind of pit him. The fuel is a bit iffy. Hopefully he can make it to the end. Fuel up the whole tar uh, fuel tank. And balanced pit stop. And, uh, yeah. And Menchaka. After pit stop down in P15. That's not too great, is it? No. Laxiden going around the final corner and he gets into the pits. Should be a pretty awesome pit stop. Yes, it is. It is a 5.7 seconds pit stop, and that's Jesus Christ. And he comes out and oh wow, P10. P10. And seven laps remaining. Lap 17, they need to pit again. Minchaka. P6 right now. Not too bad. A set of mediums. And we're gonna add six laps, uh, seven laps of fuel to his fuel tank, and balanced pit stop will do. And he's just getting challenged. Uh, he's dropped down to B seven. That's bad, I guess. Meanwhile, Laxnin, 
believe it or not, I told you, he's definitely going to get a podium. He's first right now. Of course, he didn't. He hasn't pit yet. But you can see, he has so much pace. I don't know why. But their, their parts, the, the parts they are using pretty much is pretty much the same, I mean, yes. So, I've no idea. Laxon's outperforming his teammate quite a lot. Minshaka, after pit stop uh, 11th. And, uh, no, Laxon gets that, oh, that tyre mistake. He's down to third. He's just holding up to third. And final, uh, final few corners. Laxinen uh, gets third. I told you he's gonna get a podium. Minchiaka just outside the point, and uh, yeah, it's pretty sad. Yeah, I'm. Ch I I am actually conserving my voice because it might. <laughs> it is quite iffy. So yeah, that is the race. That is overtaking masterclass from Laxinen, and yeah. He, if you meet, if you meet him, he will probably teach you how to overtake. Yeah. And uh, that, that's pretty much it, I guess. So, scrunting should be all fine. And yeah, Laxinen gets 15 points onto the podium it's for Salva Junior team or Campos Junior, whatever. And still P8 and uh, P16 for both of the drivers. And uh, yeah, P7 in the constructors. Closing down uh, Arden right now. Trying to, but yeah. So that is basically today's episode. Um, team report all looking tasty here. Two and a 25,000. 250,000 uh, lost I'm just messing up I'm so tired <laughs> yeah so um, that is today's episode hope you guys fully enjoy next time it's the Black Sea Grand Prix and you'll see the DLive logos and uh, DLive stuff and uh, yeah hope you guys fully enjoy and I'll see you guys in the next episode bye